down the hallway. Now, it's going to be a popping sound because of the two to seven inch barrel. You don't get to get the roar of a shotgun, the crack of a rifle. It's going to be pretty, just, just pop, pop, pop. Do not turn to the person next to you and say, does that sound like gunshots to you? Now, that sounds funny, but that's the first thing that most people do. First step, if you can run, run. Pop, pop, pop. Okay? But you need to understand when it's time to go, it's time to go. And you literally have people who cannot put one foot in front of the other because the, the panic has overcome the basic brainstem functions. Now, boom, doors are locked, nowhere to go. We got to, that's locked, shooters coming through this door. Can you lock your door? I don't have the answer, you tell me. Number two, can you close your drapes and blinds? Mr. Cho shot through the window in the door in order to stop the individual. There's a way to cover the window. There's another way to cover the window. We don't have to have a formal drape. But these Shut off the lights. Oh, man, this is so technical. I don't know if I can handle this. Here's what the Israelis do, and we're very fortunate to Within a few steps of the door, they're going to put a light-colored object. If somebody does come into the darkness, they're probably going to be surprised by the light-colored object. And if we're lucky, they'll try to sidestep it. They're probably not going to get hurt, but they're probably going to trip. 